so let us start uh, uh, today's class with enzyme okay so you have to study enzymes you are studying in, in studying enzymes in two places in first semester mainly we are concentrating on clinical enzymes that will come at the end uh, end of uh, other unit that is under clinical chemistry you are studying clinical biochemistry you are studying enzyme star chapter now you will see general uh, things about the enzymes i think you know already about enzymes so we are not going all the details of enzyme i want to remind you what is there in the syllabus we are concentrating okay otherwise it's a very big chapter okay uh, so we don't want to deviate from the uh, uh, our uh, syllabus okay so what are what are enzymes what are enzymes okay see enzymes are biocatalyst you know that what is catalyst what is chemical catalyst they enhance the reaction okay okay catalyst they enhance the reaction they accelerate the reaction or they increase the rate of reaction so enzymes are biocatalyst they are biological catalyst you know the meaning of catalyst they chemicals catalyst just they are chemicals they increase the rate of reaction they accelerate the reaction so these enzymes are uh, biocatalyst synthesized by living tissues hence the name biocatalyst they are synthesized by living tissue which increase the rate of reaction that is why they are called as catalyst without getting consumed in the process that is very important without getting consumed in the process they just increase the rate of reaction okay so remember most of the enzymes are protein enzymes are almost all are proteins okay but hormones hormones all hormones are not proteins there are steroid hormones then peptide hormones but almost all enzymes are proteins okay Uh, uh as i told the enzymes are biocatalyst synthesized by living tissue which increases the rate of reaction without getting consumed in the process enzymes are protein in nature most of them except some riboenzymes okay uh, so oh, so next uh, see to see in brief enzyme combined with substrate to form enzyme substrate complex and which yield enzyme uh, is uh, released without consuming and you will get the product okay you will get the product enzyme substrate we get enzyme substrate complex that is reversible reaction to get enzyme and product okay here enzyme only accelerate the reaction see just to see what is a redox reaction you know that what is reduction and what is oxidation why i am giving this in between this slide is there is a classification of enzyme to so just to give an introduction i am giving this okay redox means oxidation and reduction re means reduction o or ox means oxidation redox reactions involve the transfer of electrons e dash abbreviated 12 standard you studied from one molecule to other what is the reduction definition is when molecule gain electron oxidation when molecule lose electron okay molecule lose electron so redox reaction involve either transfer of electron gain of gain or lose of electron reduction means gain electron oxidation is when a molecule lose electron uh, electrons these together called redox reaction reduction and oxidation reaction electron is abbreviated by e a dash okay see there are different enzymes so your syllabus classification of enzymes is there this is uh, uh, put forward by international union okay iubmc classification what is iubmc international union of biochemistry and molecular biology 
they are appointed at enzyme commission so they developed a system as the name indicated it is a international system okay okay so the iubmc classification uh, this is one of the important question for you five marks remember classification of enzyme there are six classes so class 1 is oxido reductase okay iubmc there are six classes class 1 is oxido reductases class 2 transferases class 3 hydrolases class 4 we can say lyases class 5 isomerases class 6 ligases okay lyases also there ligases also there okay so we will see if a, a so exam you can write uh, the what it is and uh, one or two example uh, one example five marks means enough you can give two example it is better okay oxido reductase that is why i gave this uh, definition oxidation redox reaction oxidation and reduction so oxido reductase is enzymes involved in oxidation and reduction reaction transfer of hydrogen or addition of oxygen ldh example en en enzyme example for oxido reductase group enzymes are ldh is one example glucose 6 phosphate dehydrogenase g6pd glucose 6 phosphate dehydrogenase short form g6pd ldh is lactate dehydrogenase then succinate dehydrogenase these are the enzymes see here you can see lactate is converted to pyruvate this is the reaction and you see the arrow mark in both the side is reversible reaction a lactate dehydrogenase is the enzyme what happens is as the name indicates is oxidation reduction reaction lactase is oxidized to pyruvate nad is reduced to nadh nad is uh, coenzyme we will see in uh, coenzyme uh, nad is example for coenzyme okay nicotinamide adenine dinucleotide it is nadh reduced you call nicot reduce nadh nicotinamide a means adenine uh, dinucleotide okay uh, so nad reduced to nadh lactate is oxidized to pyruvate so again I, i i repeat any structure is not required you no need not write the structure write the name lactate uh, to pyruvate reversible reaction enzyme is ldh so ldh belongs to oxido reductase group okay so next example we can give oxido reduct uh, reductase this is one is written but it is the example two what is the example one lactate to pyruvate is the example one lactate is oxidized to pyruvate NAD is reduced to NADH. Second example is ethanol to acetaldehyde. Aldehyde CHO group is there means that is aldehyde. Ethanol C3 C2H5OH CH3 CH2OH OH group is there is ethanol. Okay. Again uh, that the formula and all no need to write. Okay. Remember exam formula no need to write for your syllabus. So remember ethanol is converted to acetaldehyde. that alcohol dehydrogenase is a enzyme which is example for oxido reductase so adh enzyme is example for here is oxido reductase ethanol is converted to alcohol with oh group converted to acetaldehyde here nad is reduced to nadh okay nad ethanol is oxidized there ethanol to oxidize to form aldehyde Uh, what is the group aldehyde cho group you can see there right side acetaldehyde ethanol with alcohol group oxidized nad is reduced here that is why reductase the name second group first group oxido reductase what are the example lactate to pyruvate lactate dehydrogenase enzyme example under ethanol converted to acetaldehyde alcohol dehydrogenase is the second example for oxido reductase second example is second uh, group enzyme is sorry second group is class 2 is transferases how many classes i told total six classes this is the second class transferases enzyme that catalyze 
transfer of functional group from one molecule to other understood this enzyme catalyzes transferase group of enzyme catalyzes transfer of functional group from one molecule to other hexokinase is example transaminases hexokinase and glucokinase these are the enzymes we will see in uh, metabolism of course metabolism is not there for you some are studying a multi group and all they will study second year third semester metabolism so hexokinase is exclusively in uh, uh, for the tissues conver conversion of glycogen to glucose okay so this is the enzyme hexokinase so it is a transfer it transfers the group see a x b a plus b gives x that is the reaction we will see the proper reaction hexose is a six sugar plus atp converted to hexo six phosphate plus atp we can write even glucose glucose is hexose no six carbon so glucose plus atp glucose six phosphate plus adp see the which group there uh, transferred phosphate okay transfer of functional group here phosphate is transferred you see hexose phosphate is added there transfer of functional group see atp from atp a phosphate group is added to hexose so hexose be converted to see the right size of the arrow mark hexose is converted to hexose six phosphate so phosphate is added there transfer of group and atp adenosine triphosphate three phosphate it is converted to adp adenosine diphosphate so enzyme is hexokinase here the group transferred is phosphate okay this is the first example for transferase second example we can give is uh, 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 pyruvate uh, plus glutamate gives alanine and alpha keto glutarate okay pyruvate plus glutamate g l u t a m a t e gives alanine plus alpha keto glutarate actually this reaction is uh, 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 transferase Uh, where well, we can see this is ALT is alanine transaminase. ALT means alanine transaminase. This enzyme particularly present in the liver. Amino group transfer here. This enzyme transfers amino group. Okay. So detailed reaction again no need. Amino group transferases AST and ALT. ALT means alanine transaminase, which is particularly present in the liver. So it is increased in liver diseases. okay so pyruvate plus glutamate converted to alanine plus alpha keto glutarate here amino group transfer is there enzyme is alt alt means alanine trans aminase okay alt so to example you remember third group of enzyme under iubm c iubm b classification is hydrolases what are the first oxidoreductases transferases okay under transferases hexose to hexo 6 phosphate second example pyruvate to uh, glutamate to alanine plus alpha keto glutarate alt is the example third hydrolases as the name indicated indicated hydrolases catalyze the splitting of molecules by hydrolysis splitting of molecules by hydrolysis means using water h2o molecule hydrolysis catalyzes the splitting of molecules by hydrolysis using water like ab plus h2 no need to worry that much there is the simple the a plus b h2 ah and boh see there are various enzymes you study is disaccharide maltase lact lactose maltose sucrose what is the enzyme for that see these are the enzymes okay so hydrol hydrolysis hydrolysis catalyze the uh, cata catalyze the uh, splitting of molecules by hydrolysis that is using water molecules so lac lactose you know that it is disaccharide it is converted to monosaccharide that is glucose and galactose you know that composition of lactose is glucose and galactose enzyme is lactase so hydrolysis means using h2o molecule okay there are many maltose is converted to glucose and uh, glucose and glucose two molecules you know that again maltose is uh, malt sugar 
maltase is the enzyme so again using water molecule isomaltose isomaltase is the enzyme lactose lactase is the enzyme already we have seen this sucrose sucrose is a non reducing sugar you studied in carbohydrate disaccharide sucrase is the enzyme which convert glucose and fructose here the reaction is hydrolysis using h2o okay so 